What's up everybody, Jen is out here, and this right here is the most underrated character in Wuthering Waves, Shisha. I've seen a lot of tier lists around, and no one is putting any respect on her name, so I decided on a challenge. I will solo every single one of the hardest bosses with Shisha to prove that she's actually top tier. Now here's the thing, Shisha uses guns, so she can't parry, and since I'm using her by herself, I also can't use intro or outro attacks, which are some of the most important mechanics of the game, so I don't get any of the utility or the damage or the stagger bar decrease of them. Now, what I do have is a fully leveled Chisha using the five star static miss standard weapon, all fully leveled with crit chance. I also have all of our talents absolutely maxed. I do also have Resonance 6 Chisha. Keep in mind though, she is a four star and also a couple of these resonances are completely useless in a boss battle. I also have these absolutely monster Echoes. I luck sacked these in a single day, so I guess it was destined. If you like this video, or even if you hate it, subscribe to the channel. So can we finish this gauntlet of bosses? Let's find out. Alright, we're gonna start with this. Sing sing. Yeah, it's gonna shoot this. Dodge that little like Melania attack. Ooh, that was close. All right, dodge all those, nice and simple. Ooh, I almost kind of messed that up by moving. Unfortunately, I can't parry. Boss can't really hit you if you're against the wall there. Okay, we're gonna use this. This boss is getting absolutely destroyed right now. This damage is insane. Now we use this, do a million damage. That attack gets me when I'm really unprepared. I hate it. Ooh. Barely cut it in close. I'm just gonna ult. Get the hell out of here, dude. Easy. We're gonna try and learn a super cool trick here, okay? Okay, let's see it use that charge. Bro, use the attack. What are you doing? Just hanging around. I think I got that at the right time and it didn't work. I don't know, man. I don't think it works, guys. All right, just dodge that. Turn into a bird. I'm somewhat of a bird myself. Okay. The craziest part is that my Chisha can actually get more damage. I didn't even think it was possible. Just iframe this. I'm thinking that this is the run, to be honest. We're gonna save our ult for the next phase. This boss has like no health bar, so it's just so easy to kill without using all of your damage. You don't even have to play perfectly in this boss at all, other than not getting hit, right? So I'm just gonna ult here. We're just gonna ignore that. Ooh, and then I'm gonna turn into a bird. We're gonna dodge, go right up in its face, because it's gonna use the stupid breath attack. I used that slide just to make sure I wasn't gonna get hit. This is the only boss that I feel like I can't just like perfectly dodge everything, so I feel like I have to use like iframes and crap. Whoa, it shot some extra feathers out, by the way. It's gonna go into, yeah, yeah, it's like cocoon phase, I guess you could call it. It gets its entire bar back, pretty much. As you can see, all of its moves start to really waste a lot of time. I'm gonna ult on it, huge damage. This boss starts to become a real pain on the time department at the end. But it's no problemo, we're gonna turn into a bird again. Still have a minute and a half. Alright. Oh my god! I f the stupid ass bird in its shitty camera! I want you guys to know, this is the only boss Rexent literally screamed out loud and said he, and he never does that, ever, against anything. This boss is so bad! <laughs> it's just a terribly designed boss! Just cause the camera, dude! We're getting lots of damage down. Not fun at all, man. Alrighty. Let's go for the second one. Look how much damage you do just at the start of the fight with two of those. Kind of crazy. When you look at the fact that this is like one of the highest level bosses in the game. Kind of insane. You can just turn into a bird to dodge that. Nice and simple. We don't want to risk anything. Bird versus bird. 
Uh, I was dodging correctly, but I'll just go for the iframes on this too. No reason not to. Whoa, that was close. That attack is really nasty. Comes out of nowhere and it's delayed. We're just gonna turn into a bird for the parry so we can't get hit there. The boss is just about at half health, so it might turn into its next phase after either next attack or right here. Okay, I guess after this. Oh. Whew, turning into a bird there was really good. I'm just gonna use this on it. Huge damage. Now we gotta get close to it because it's gonna use the breath. And the breath attack is by far the most dangerous attack this boss can do. This is a very Dark Soulsy type boss. It tries to catch you with awkward timing all the time. So we just about have ult back up. We could use it here. Get a ton of damage. Perfect. Go into skill use. It might go up into the air though. Oh, nope, it has to do this because it's really low on its stagger bar, so it has no choice but to waste its time just going into its little cocoon. The only problem is that when this boss gets to really low health, it starts getting a little bit desperate. I'm just gonna ult that. I'm gonna double dodge there. I'm gonna make sure we don't get hit by the fire. It hasn't used either of its last ditch attacks either. It's gonna try and use it here. But we're gonna kill it first, so it doesn't matter. Nice. Easy. First try. <laughs> now we do this. This is the fight right here, right now. We take out Monkey 6, which I've never beaten before, even in the beta, with Chisha solo. Let's do this. This is it. Ooh, barely dodged in time, but we did. We iframe this. Uh, I don't know if that was gonna iframe, to be honest. I went for a dodge at the end. Dodge really far back. Huge damage. 18,000 from that. But then we go for the run and gun again. Two and a half minutes and he's already more than half dead. That's one. Whoo, that was close. Oh! I had to go slightly higher. We've got two Petrols left, but we're not gonna need the last one because we're gonna kill them now. Let's go. All right, we start this. We immediately go into Ghost Rider, which we then use the ult to do a ton of damage and iframe. Great start to the fight, just so much damage on board. We're gonna immediately start doing this, even though we can't do a full charge. Actually, we did get a full charge, wow. We dodge backwards. Because you really wanna build up her stacks. It's really important. He's gonna slam the ground now. Mm, we didn't actually get the attack after a little bit of a damage loss, to be honest. He's about to go into phase two right here, probably. Oh, or not. It's actually kind of good, because it means I get the ult off on him right here. And they're throwing the poop at me. Whoa, that was close. I'm just going to spam all these bullets down, because I have my ult up now. Gives me all those bullets back. We almost have our ult. We still have a minute left. I'd say as long as we don't make any big screw-ups, this is pretty free. We're gonna throw that into this, into the 30,000 crit at the end. Wow, that is insane. We're doing this so that we still have our stacks of our gun, because it only lasts for 10 seconds. Gotta make sure you have that. Now we're gonna ult. Huge damage. Into just all this and sayonara that easy and our reward is the worst drop ever that's what i'm talking about yeah I, guys i think chisha is genuinely good but i think it's impossible to clear this i don't think chisha can possibly uh, beat this boss solo at level 70 the boss just has too much health and it's just non-stop attacking if i can learn how to parry on chisha maybe it would be possible but i think you guys are gaslighting me like as you can see i just don't really do any damage even if I perfectly dodge everything, I just don't think it's possible. Should I try parrying? Let's see. Oh, you can't parry that. Let's, let's try parrying. Oh. Dude, it's so hard to aim! Bye, have a great time. I don't think you can shoot fast enough. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Whoa. Okay. Itaite! 
I don't think this works, guys. Okay, so I couldn't actually beat Mephis 6 with just Chisha. I can't parry the boss, and its health bar is massive. I literally don't have enough damage with her in five minutes. So let's try it with an actual team. You guys think we can actually kill this boss with this team? What do you think? All right, let's do this. Heal, turtle. Perfect parry with Jian. That's his entire purpose here, is to parry, and he's doing a great job. Ooh, that didn't quite work. That's fine. Can't win them all, right? Alright. The sunlight's in my eye. Every possible detrimental thing. Holy, that was close. We really have to use Jian just for these parries. We're gonna surf on him. We got all that damage bonus, now we go in. I really should have used this first, but too late now. But we also get the ult. Huge damage! Hold 43,000! I've never done that much damage in my life! We're gonna surf on him. Give me the heal. Start gunning him down again. We're gonna parry. Swap to Chisha. Huge damage. Swap to Verena. Give me that parry. We're gaming! I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna have to dodge right after. Uh, that was weird. I guess the iframes got a little confused there. That's fine, though. Oh, uh, if I had timed that differently, I could have used it to parry. That's fine, though. We're gonna shoot it. We're making amazing time right now. We're gonna parry this. Ooh, we didn't land the parry, it seems. I'm just gonna ult through this. Unfortunately, that count still is the iframes there. I'm gonna use him to parry. Alright. We're gonna dodge all that. Nice and simple. Ooh, I actually got hit. Ooh, the be saved by the bell, literally. Ooh, that was close. Scary. Let's dodge that. Give me that bell. That was a damage boost. Ooh, I could have just done this, but that works too. We're gonna ult into swap. Into jump, into swap again. Knock his ass down. Easiest fight of my entire life. Holy... We're gonna iframe this with our ult. Waste a ton of time. Oh, we got the parry too. Perfect. We're gonna parry this. Ooh, I don't know if that actually worked, to be honest. That's fine, though. We're gonna iframe this. Huge damage. Holy! Not even the sun can stop us. In my eyes, I can't see anything the hell down you little punk ass oh now he's wasting time get a load of this clown he knows he's losing oh i made a mistake that's fine we can surf on him with this we ult we swap into Verena. Oh! Holy! 
That was the most insane run! Shisha's outro skill does like 50,000 damage right there. <laughs> Nuked his ass. Alright, so we soloed three out of the four endgame bosses in Wuthering Waves. This surely must prove that she's a pretty good character, right? Just kidding. Alright, we couldn't beat Mephis in one go with her, but that's the hardest boss in the game. It requires a lot of pairing, so she's not really suited for it. But she's pretty much good at everything else I've encountered in the game. Thanks a bunch for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Watch me at twitch.tv slash genizod, and I'll see you next time.